Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I want to talk to you guys about bitterness. So I went home last weekend because it was my mama's birthday and last year I wasn't able to go back home. So this year I made it a priority to go home for her birthday. And when I got back home, of course I went to church. And when I went to church, my dad was talking about bitterness. Like that was kind of the theme of his message for that Sunday and let me tell y'all if there wasn't any other message that he has ever preached for me that message was for me and I just kind of wanted to give y'all some advice of like the things that he said because that really did help me <laughs> like for real so he was talking about bitter bitterness and he was talking about how being bitter does not help you does not help the plans that God has for your life does not make you a successful person and that just rang true like there's a lot of things that's going on right now and this week I feel like I've just been taking L's all week and I've kind of been in a stupor and in like a little mood because things not things aren't going my way, with which they're not, but things aren't even going the way that they could be going. Or they're not going in the best way possible. And I feel like everything that I planned, like, you know, you have a little plan in your head. Like, all of that is just falling apart right now. And I'm not liking it. And, you know, there's other situations where there's people involved and you feel bitter towards those people. And... I had to realize that me feeling bitter towards those situations and towards those people, they're not going to benefit me in any way possible. And I can't live my life being bitter and I can't live my life always having that bitterness inside of me because like my dad said, you being bitter or you being resentful is just like you drinking poison and then waiting for that situation or for that person to die. Like, that's not going to help you and it's not going to kill them. So you just need to stop. And that just rang so much truth for me from last week and this week. So I just wanted to share that quick advice with you guys. So if you are bitter, you don't need to be. Stop being bitter because that will not help your situation at all you need to think of a solution to help you get over whatever the obstacle is whoever the obstacle is and then move on from that situation and don't ever put yourself in a situation like that ever again because it will not be beneficial to you or your plans or your success so that is just a piece of advice that I want to share with you today. So I also want to give you guys some updates about what's been going on. So a couple of days ago, we had International Women's Day. And for International Women's Day, our university brought Myra Brock Akil. And if you don't know who she is, she is the creator of Being Mary Jane, Girlfriends. And she also produced The Game and The Jamie Foxx Show. And so she came to our university and she gave a little lecture about how, you know, she didn't think that she would be, she was going into journalism and then she went into producing and she really loved it. And then she wanted to produce her own shows about black women and our problems and our struggles and dealing with our lives. And her, she was just a wonderful and phenomenal speaker. And I really, really did enjoy her. I got a picture with her right here and she was just a pleasure to see and a pleasure to talk with and like just have this discussion about women in you know media and of course black women. You always get these stereotypical roles and how it just there's more sides of us and she tries to show those multiple sides of the, the complex black woman other than, you know, just the normal angry black women that we usually see on our television shows. And so I really, really appreciated that. And I thought that that was something that was so, so great that we had on campus for Tuesday. Um, but other than those two things, I have just been ready for spring break. Spring break is next week and I am so ready because I'm just going home <laughs> like I'm not doing anything I'm just going home but you know going home is a great thing being in your own bed is wonderful and doing absolutely nothing but Netflix and 
watching stuff. It's just wonderful. So that's what I'll be doing for my spring break most likely. And that's okay. And I'll make sure to vlog um, during spring break time. Maybe I can do some um, special guests. Maybe with like my friends and stuff. I don't know. I guess we'll see. But anyways, I'm going to sign out, you guys. Um, so remember, don't be bitter. And eradicate that bitterness out of your life. And I hope you guys have a great week. I will see you guys next week.